Lisa, I know the life-saving potential of umbilical cord stem cells, but how do I go about preserving my baby's stem cells? Is it like a long process? It is a simple five-step process and this is how it happens. First step for umbilical cord blood banking is to sign up for the service a few weeks before your delivery date. It helps to sign up with a trustworthy company. Once you enroll, you'll be handed an umbilical cord collection kit. Keep your doctor informed about the decision and make sure that you carry the kit with you as you leave to the hospital for delivery. The collection process is a simple 10-minute procedure and poses no harm to either the mother or baby. Basically, after the baby is born, the umbilical cord is clamped at both ends, separated from the mother and baby, sterilized and thereafter the blood is collected in a bag provided with the collection kit. After the blood is drained, the remaining umbilical cord is also collected and placed into the kit. The mother's blood samples are also collected to check for the presence of transmittable diseases. The collection kit is then couriered to the laboratory through a specialized logistics provider. Once the sample is handed to our personalized courier service, the collection kit is shipped by a immediate flight with special instructions to avoid X-ray scan. The sample is picked up through logistics concierge service immediately on arrival at the airport and delivered safely. As soon as the lab receives the collection kit, the samples are individually checked into our laboratory software and then taken for processing. The stem cells in the blood are extracted by adding a chemical and spun at high speeds to separate the various components. The middle layer contains the stem cells which are transferred to a special freezing bag. The stem cells from the tissue are extracted by mincing the tissue into smaller portions liquefied by adding an enzyme and transferred to special cryovials. The processed stem cell units are mixed with cryopreservatives to ensure long-term preservation. Using a special type of freezer, stem cells are slowly frozen to an ultra-cold temperature of minus 196 degrees centigrade. The multi-layer power backup systems and liquid nitrogen ensure uninterrupted cryopreservation of your baby's precious stem cells for decades. A preservation certificate is sent for your records. My baby's future will be in safe hands. I just have one question. Why didn't they invent this technology earlier when I was a baby in my mother's belly?